Hey, I'm Tyler, your host of Vaping Daily, and today we're going to review the iClear 30 Clearomizer, provided to us by our friends over at VapingExtreme.com. Let's take our first look at the iClear 30. It comes in a very nice presentation box that has a clear front, which gives you a very positive first impression. The iClear 30 is packaged very well, so it's not damaged in transit. Here we have the iClear 30 unpackaged. You can see its stainless steel construction, your 8 wick dual coil atomizer head, and its swivel drip tip. This product's very easy to dismantle, let's go take a look at it. Here we have our drip tip, our tank cap, the acrylic tank, your 8 wick atomizer head, and your 510 threaded base cap. Alright, let's take a look at the iClear 30. It comes in a nice hard plastic case. Um, and it's got a great little swivel tip on it. And that's one of the biggest features that stood out to me about this because it's not really available on anything else in the market right now. Um, and it's really easy to disassemble. It is rebuildable. So first we'll take off our drip tip. Then we'll take off our top cap which has an o-ring inside to keep the seal and keep your e-juice from leaking out. Then you've got your acrylic tank, your atomizer head, which has 8 wicks compared to the iClear 16's 4 wicks or the VV Nova's 4 wicks. This device is also dual coil, so you're going to get a superior vapor production. And you've also got an o-ring and the bottom cap. This is 510 threaded so it will be compatible with most of your devices out there right now. The drip tip is compatible with the iClear 16 or a CE4. Let's get this put back together real quick. It usually runs about 2.2 ohms. Um, I've got two of these and both of them, when I check them, they're at about 2.2 ohm resistance. So let's take a hit at 7 watts with a 70-30 VGPG blend. It's got great vapor production at about 7 watts. Now we've got its little brother, the iClear 16. Let's take a comparison hit at 7 watts. And that clear miser did have the same 70-30 VG to PG blend. And uh, let me take this off my EVIC and we'll compare a VV Nova to those two. Now VV Nova is a single coil clearomizer, so just take that into consideration. And this one is running at 2.4 ohms, so I'm going to bump it up to say 7.5 watts. Now, with the iClear 30, it is about the same as the iClear 16. What you gain with the iClear 30 is that it is a 3 milliliter uh, tank volume, where the iClear 16 is a 1.6 milliliter um, tank volume. You also gain a stainless steel construction with the acrylic tank and a swivel drip tip that is all metal. It does not give you a metal taste when you are hitting it, so that's very nice. So overall, I'm really impressed with the iClear 30. I've used it for the past couple of days, and I've really enjoyed it. It's been consistent. It doesn't get the burnt taste to it. Um, the atomizer head is replaceable. You can get those at vapingextreme.com for about $3 and the iClear 30 itself is about $12 on vapingextreme.com. Thanks again for watching and have a nice day.